<laughs> Continue. Strange whole culture, welcome to another day. Day 12. Tuesday. Tuesday, isn't it? Here in Strange Hall Culture, the legacy that's left to my uncle, his pimp shop, aka medicinal shop with an underground strip club, that hopefully we will be seeing very soon. Um, yeah, the shop's open. We got a kitty over here named Sativa, looking good, looking fine, looking cute, looking soft, looking good, looking fine, looking cute, looking soft. I can't think of other adjectives. You know, one thing I'm going to say before we start this is before I open up shop and, you know, did my I, we kind of opened up the shop today is what it's what it's what like at 149 so you know it's like a after lunch opening up the shops so during lunch um i was on twitch and like i was trying to put something on in the background <clears throat> as we we're you know working in the shop you know because we don't got customers all day every day coming in and out we you got downtime so in the background i put some stuff to watch sometimes it's just, right now we got secret window playing but then off to the other side of the screen i got a 49 incher so like half the screen is a secret window half the screen is like a twitch or whatever or like any other thing i like putting someone on someone on who's live so it's like they're playing with me like we're gaming together or we're like being in the world of time together if that makes sense um one thing i never understood is like people just the whole body painting thing like chicks be topless with pasties on and people be okay with that like I'm not hating it. I'm like, you know, you do you. If, you know, that's what you want to make cash. That's how you want to bring in the guap. Like, go for it. You know, that's how you do it. But like, imagine like, you all you got to press to watch a stream like that is it, it, before you open it, it like ask you or as you open it, it ask you that, hey, do you want to, this is a mature stream. Do you want to continue? All you got to do is click a, click a button and say yes. There's no verification or anything. So like, they'd be like little kids out there and they'd be just seeing this chick topless with pasties on coloring herself. You know, I just, I don't know. I'm going to throw that out there. We're not watching that right now, but I saw someone, so I clicked it. And it would look kind of gross just because the whole, the way it was going. Because usually it ain't like fine chicks be doing that. It'd be like, you know, average chicks trying to get views or whatever. I don't know. You do you. You know, if that's how you want to bring your business. That's all on you. I'm just saying that chicks usually be ugly. But we'll be doing that stuff. But, or average, I don't know. But just ugly. I'm going to just go with the word. I said it, I'm going to stick with it. But it just, it throws me off the bone where I'm like, how's that okay man like a little kid could be watching that stuff man homie be homie be getting jaded watching this stuff man whether a boy or a girl be getting jaded off of that and um yeah so i just wanted to throw my two cents out there uh, i want to throw my 69 cents out there and see what happens see what sticks to the wall but here we are again let's go back to the main thing strange whole culture we have our medallion we have our talisman from dakishan adventures actually this one would be a talisman right what are we supposed to be doing? Willingness to explore. Pet the kitty. Continuously pet the kitty. And then ring the doorbell. Oh, that was loud. Bethany. I'm talking about you, a chick named Beth. I still know her. Not like she's not dead or like out of my life. She came for us. We were attacked in the night by the servant. In all my time in the forest, I have never experienced anything like what happened last night. I forgot I can click to make it go faster. The forest came alive and drove the beast away. Ah, oh, Juinia saved us. It's the only explanation that makes any sense. Of course, the Chorley who just got goddamn decapitated came to save you, sure. One thing is clear, we cannot do this alone, and we must not allow the summon to get its hands on what it's looking for. Booty cheeks. It's looking for some booty cheeks. I'm trusting you with this. A secret that the Sisterhood has kept for hundreds of years. A tool to defeat the Woken Dandruff. Keep it safe. Use it wisely. You'll know how to open it, of course. Who you is, dog? The sister. Noise. Uh, can we add the word step in front of that? In the middle of the, the and the sister? Uh, Bethany was born. Uh, loving family. Never settled. Did we read this already? I'm pretty sure we read everybody already by now. Out of all these people, she looks the coolest. Just because she has a mask on and stuff. Have you ever you been to I've been to those parties. Once, once in my life. I haven't, I haven't done it multiple times. I've been to a mask party. And let me tell you. Like perception of what a good looking person is can so easily be um perceived in the wrong way with just a mask covering you know the top portion you could be looking at goddamn lips and chin you're like you know what shorty be fine she take the mask off and got a lazy eye so like i'm just saying like you need the full picture these mask places it's like a it's like a it's like a call for like ugly people to just show up and like take over but just saying 
don't go to these mask parties man well go to them just go to more just go to many of them don't just go to one of them just go go to many of them and you might you know i don't know luck might be on your side collect the item oh what's that oh guardian of the forest save the sisterhood Okay, so there's a hole that needs to be penetrated. Now, if my uncle has taught me anything, I need to unzip. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I need to use that plant, don't I? I gotta use that plant that, um... Um... That plant that opened the locksmith plant. The plant that I use to commit robberies. Bank heist. Um... Okay. So, what is it called? I, don't, I have no idea what it's called. I'm sorry, I'm just like all over the place. Plus, I'm getting like 30 million texts right now. Which is another story for another day. But, uh... Alright, we're looking for a locksmith. So, the one with the check marks, you gotta read that. Something about locks. It just says lock, right? Like, super easily says to pick locks or whatever. No, speed read the hell out of this. I don't see lock. I'm looking for the word lock. There it is, lock. Open, according to the legend, Cavalicalium can be used to open any lock, no matter how complex or secure. The hot shaped leaves have earned this plant the nickname Love a Lock. That's, that's not a heart, that's a booty, right? That's some cheese, that's a crack right there. If you're talking to me, if you're telling me what it is, if you're telling me what it is, all right. Uh, Cavalicalium. We already have this one. Let's look for the heart one and then we can move forward. This one? No should be painstakingly obvious, but I'm blind. So we're just going to go one by one. Kavalikilium. Oh, see, I was about to skip that one, too. Kavalikilium. Is that right there? That was loud, dog. That was loud, homie. Follow the Dundon tributary to its source. First is the corpse's friend. Oh, see, capitalized. Wait. See, F doesn't stand for... F could be like... No, I don't know. I was going to say F could be stand for West, but it, it's not. It's not what it is. First is the corpse's friend, a reminder. Then comes the ankle grabber. <laughs> I'm telling you, this game has so many like double meaning sexual stuff in this game that I'm not even I'm like ankle grabber. Everyone knows what ankle grabber means, man. All right. The binder. All right. Bondage. Like, I'm not even playing with you this game. It's on another level, man. Like, you telling me this ain't a medicinal shop. You telling me that we don't got an underground strip club. That you need to read the first couple of sentences of this goddamn thing. The ankle grabber. The binder. Third is a fear bringer. Fourth, to lift a curse. Last, a pedal to secure black blood's reverse. All right, so like five steps. Follow the Dundon tributary to its source. Um, okay. So these are steps. I'm not an idiot. These are steps. So let's get our note out here and let's get this. Okay. First is the corpse's friend a reminder. Mm. First is the corpse's friend. So the corpse C F. Corpse's friend. Can I open up? Yeah, the book. Ankle grabber. Mm. Okay, so since the Ankle grabber. Fear bringer. Fourth to lift a curse. Okay, and then fifth is last a petal. Secure black blood's reverse. Okay, so I'm not an idiot. This is referring to plants. All of the Dundon tribute to its source. So, somewhere on the map. Okay, first is a corpse's friend. Um, first is a corpse's friend. Corpse's friend. Corpse's friend. Okay, so that has to be... Okay, first is the corpse's friend. Okay, that has to be a name of a plant. Because a lot of these plants we've learned from the last episode, a lot of these plants have double names, nicknames, things like that. So, does, and do you guys see anything that says... See, this is known, nickname is Lovelock. Found on Red Pike. Corpse's friend, right here. Devil's Nightcap is Corpse's friend. If ingested as a seed, it will cause a slow, agonizing death. 
and the plant will grow out of the body once deceased. It's like alien type stuff, huh? Alien type, alien versus predator type thing. It has a light, pleasant scent, not similar to, not dissimilar to pine needles. Boiling the root in vinegar creates a tonic against fevers and poisons. Okay, so we know. First, what do I need to do with the plant though? I don't get it. Like, what am I supposed to do with the plant though? Am I supposed to like find the plant? Oh, can I throw the plant on here? Wait, 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 wait. Can I, can you throw a plant on here? How do I use the plant? Okay, so the first one is the corpse's friend. I don't get it. Like, if I say I found the right plant, how do I, um, let's first find the devil's nightcap. Uh, this? It's kind of looks like the devil's nightcap. Drop this on here. Hmm. The coin. Does the coin do anything? First, it's a corpse's reminder. Hmm. How do I, like, perform the ritual? Follow the Dundon tribute tributes. So do I need to go? Okay, first let's. Okay. Okay, first, so I can't throw stuff on here. So I'm guessing. Remember how we went to that one place where I need five plants? I need to draw five plants. So I'm guessing this is the five plants. Remember the one place we went? Where was that? Ah, uh, Williams to explore. The Great Oak. This is the Great Oak. Where is that one place we went that it was like um, Swineside Circle? We went to one place where it was like, I need to do something here. I need Verona Green's help. Or I need like five things here. Where is that at? Because I think I need to first go there. Find the uh, Dundin Tribute. Find the Dundin Tribute. Find. Follow the Dundin Tributary to its source. Why do I feel like... Didn't I do this already? I went to one of these places said, uh... This place right here, right? This was it? This was... Okay, we got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. Um... I think it's this. But I needed Verona Green Salt for this, so it might not be that. Oh my god, why are these all out? What kind of garbage game is this? Okay. Wasn't this like right here somewhere? Right there. No, but I need Verona's Green. That's where the this Grizzle Forest is like right here somewhere, but that's not where we're supposed to be at. Follow the Dundon tribute to its source. Okay. Whatever. Red Pike, Great Gable, Jake, Grasmere. Has to be something called Dundin up in this hoe. Well, first look at the places before we look at the rivers. Or the bodies of water. Okay, Serta, and more, White Crane, Arzinda, Bajapshan, Sasakindle, Rudermere, Lake, Hillside, Dungeon, Dundin. No, that's the wrong one. Crinkle crabs, crusty crabs, wasp water, mega shad, gossifer, the river Iral, river S, goodle, raven, stone circle. What does that say? D U Dundon. That's the one. Follow the Dundon tribute to its source. Follow the Dundon tribute to its source. Hard knock. I don't think it's this because this goes into this area. This isn't the source. It's either this or this. It starts off here and then it goes in here. Or it starts off hard knot. Hard knot. You know what? I'm gonna go for this one first and we'll go for this one. What's the river source? Wait, is there like another place called Dundon? Hmm. 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go here first. What the hell? Nothing here. Okay, we'll go to the next one, other one. If that doesn't work, if, if that doesn't work, this one right here doesn't work, then we'll go to... See, that one's right at the cusp. Like, there's all four of these make up that. See, I don't think it's this, because this would be too hard to pick. It's too big of an area. So yeah, I think it's this then. Okay, so we need, uh... Oh, we need to water the plants. We need to water the damn plants. Nice. Go ahead and restart the music. Nice. Same soundtrack over and over again. Love to hear it. Love to see it. Love to feel it. We're at the part in Secret Window where uh, he's at the sheriff's office. Okay, first <laughs> ankle grabber. I gotta know which plant that is. So I think that um, with the... Come on, dog. Okay, so I think this is capitalized. Corpse's friend. That's a plant. Ankle grabber. The binder. That I think could be two nicknames for one plant. Fear bringer. I don't know why this isn't capitalized, but it has to be a nickname. Fourth is to lift a curse. I remember there's a plant out there that you can use to lift a curse. I remember that. And I also know that there's something uh, for the black secure black bloods reverse. I remember that as well because that is another plant where it's like. Um, your veins or something become blasted. These are all related to the five plants we need for a ritual. I remember that part. Um, so if this place isn't where you do the ritual right here, then I don't know. Then I think we have to go to Grisdale Forest. That one place right here. So this little shorty right here. But I need Verona Green for that. So either this is going to be wrong. We'll go here. Then we'll go here. And if that doesn't work, then we'll wait for Verona Green or something. We'll just try to figure out um, what to do next. Uh, let's go here because this could be find the Dundon tribute source. I'm going to guess this because this kind of leads out and this is actually a perfect like this is a perfect square with this ending in here. This is a perfect square with this ending in here. This right here is at the cusp. So I can't pick any of these or I could pick either, all of them. Or they, could all, they could all work. But I don't think that's a source of a river that flows into like an ocean or whatever. I don't think that flows as a river. The river starts off here or here. So I'm going to go with this next. I've never seen this plant before, and here and here it is growing in abundance. The hell is that? Dungeon tributary to a source. I have the the plants though. What do I do with the? All right, so we were right. Oh my god. Okay, the plants. Okay, I guess we just wait. I guess we don't. I thought we we're doing the ritual, but I guess we're right. We need Verona Green for the ritual, so I guess we can't. We got the plant. I got we got another plant out of this. Where is it at? Where is it at? Where's that trash plant at? I don't remember. Oh, is this one right? Or this one? Yeah, it's this one right here. Okay. Alright, so I guess we don't do the ritual. First is the corp. Okay, so we'll just look at these plants when we need them then. This is garbage. Stupid game. Pet the kitty, and then we'll wake it up. What do you want, David Shafter? Okay, so at least we now know that the puzzle are planned nicknames and stuff like that. And I kind of, we got to look for the nicknames for the first three and the second two, the fourth and fifth are plants that I've come across. The black blood veins or whatever, and then the curse. All right, what you saying, dog? They're saying the sisterhood has been attacked. Don't care. Don't know much more than that, but those Caesar Redemptions have got all, got all excited about it. There's a bunch of them chanting outside pole viewers right now. That is not the kind of cult that I want to join. I want to join the cult where there's like body on body action going on. I have a garbage uh, cult is this? What is this? Fox Field Trident. All right, this is super easy. So whenever we get a letter like this, there's two words. The second word pertains to a thing on here. So Aquaman, where you at dog? Right here, Aquaman Trident. So now we just look for Fox Field. Um. Foxfield right here. I remember, I remember I saw it because we were looking over here. So we grab this thingy, we put it on Foxfield, grab Trident, and we just pick that one right there. From Foxfield, the Trident points me in the direction of some foothills northwest of Swineside Stone Circle. A faint path, faint path leads me over a ridge and into into a dell, dell laptop. Here, a plant thrives sheltered from the wind. 
Come on, how many plus, how many days do I ever play this game, man? After a while, I don't know how much you care about that that green green, that, that Kush lifestyle, but like enough is enough. I forgot what that plan looked like, but I'm guessing I think it's one of these, right? Both the goddamn same. Okay, we got that one done. That was the freebie right there. I love getting those because they're a freebie. Kitty, wake up. Forest flare. I am going back to the black comb. I will kill this servant. Many my people have saying he who lives without fear does not live at all. I will not say that I'm not afraid, but it would be no bad thing to die hunting such a noble adversary. I will take Ember Soul. So if you guys remember that cold dude, that that redneck came to us and he was like, oh, give you, you that dude comes to your shop, that homie, your brother or whatever comes to the shop, give him this plant. So basically, I guarantee you the plant's either going to kill him. I just, I only think it's going to kill him. I don't think it's going to do anything else. But yeah, we're not doing that. We're not killing a homie off like that, man. This is the content, man. Brotherhood, dog. I'm not killing off a homie, dog. That redneck can go go eat his own booty hole out, but I'm not killing the homie, dog. What the hell you kind of thing? Elder, what did you want? Ember soul? What do you have, Ember soul? I am not killing you like that, my homie. He's my dog, homie. Ember soul. I wish we could do like a little search and find it. I have to go through all of these? Oh, pig. I have to go through all of these to find it. There you go, my dog. Eat that thing from the back, make it look good. Even though I don't like that he's an arms dude and he's always high up on that. He's a hippie, but he's our hippie. I'm not killing off a homie like that, man. You must be out of your mind if I'm about to kill a homie. All right, my uncle got shot. All right. Widows, whoa. What is it? Hit it. Hit him with the, what is it? Hit it with the, whoa. What is that song? Whoa. I remember that song. I, I gotta Google that thing. Uh, one second. You two. Actually, no, we'll do it afterwards. Um. Yo, 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 Kiki. Wake up, Kiki. Thank you, Kiki. What up, Milton Bulbs? Oh, he's the dude to create for us. Allow me to present my services. I own a small shop that specializes in curiosities. Sexual curiosities or what? Oh, what I have to, uh, I remember, it reminds me of that thing where Tobias goes to buy a outfit or a wig or something. And he keeps going to this, like, um, I think it's a gay shop. I don't know what it is. But um, he goes there and he's like, um, you're always coming in here, but you're not buying anything. And uh, Tobias replies with, well, you, I guess you can call me. You, uh, I guess you can say that I am bi curious. And by bi, he didn't mean B-I. By bi, he meant B-U-I curious. <laughs> I would have thought that someone in your position ought to be interested in pursuing our collection of manuscripts on Alexis, for example. Call me. You ain't getting into my pants that easily, dog. Okay, so Arnest side um antiques. Okay, let's go find this place. I already found it, it's right there. Arnside. What was it called? Arnside Antiques. Why do I gotta visit a shop to get the stuff? The dark exterior of Arnside Antiques blends into the surroundings, a tailor called Jones and an ugly looking haberdashery. Haberdashery. To the extent to, to the extent that I walked past it three times before I found it. Inside, however, I am greeted by a world of intrigue and wonder. Old trinkets sit alongside faded books and manuscripts while strange utensils and machines, their use is unfathomable. I occupy a corrosive of couple of displays. I read that so wrong. It is some time before I peel myself away, returning to underwear with two, new, two new recipes for elixirs that demand further study. St. Quentin, that jail, right? Okay, I think the day's done. So I'm gonna throw this here. Um, basically, we haven't really accomplished a lot in day 12 because at least we have this. So now we know what plants we need. We just have to, I don't know if plants that we already know or plants we'll have to find. It doesn't show a picture. So I don't know if I'll have to really find out if I'm using the right ones or not. Um, but yeah, that's that. And then the cult told me wanted to kill off the uh the cold douchebag redneck wanted us to kill off a homie we ain't doing that so we gave him the plant that he asked for and not something fake to kill him because again 
I don't care what kind of cult you in, we ain't killing anybody like that, man. We ain't killing a brother like that, dog. And the damn day, dog. And the damn day. Oh, my bad. I thought I was thinking do it by itself. And more raven spider. There's a spider on that thingy that we use, that thingy that we have. And then there's a raven on there as well. This, the spider that bit the raven from Assassin's Creed. And there's also a spider from uh, Assassin's Creed, uh, from uh, Spider-Man. Equipped with Ada's knowledge, she journeyed west of the stone circle. Unknown to her, she was not alone as she made her preparations. Ooh, she about to get clapped. She about to get whacked. Okay. Okay, and more. Underwear. Uh, again, we're just gonna cruise through this, and if we find it, we find it. If we don't find it, we don't find it. Oh wait, I need my uh, Raven's look. Foxfield, I was about to go there. And more. Uh, which reminds me of uh, Elder Scrolls. Okay, so we grab the car first. We grab this and we put it on here. Raven. So the Raven points us right here. So what is that? H29. So we put this right here. Is that H29? And then we go Spider next. So there. Noise! A jackdaw creaks hidden somewhere nearby. Strange shapes of old stones. Two more plans! Pierce the long grass, among them some plants grow. God damn, that is loud, huh? That is loud, homie. Oh, that looks like a little peach type, uh, what do you call it? Peach type, uh... I was clicking, but nothing was happening. Oh, okay, so I hate the way that I've, I, I've set up my uh, goddamn plants, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Okay. Um, day 13, Wednesday. Welcome to the shop. We are here with some more extravagant news. Uh, my uncle is still dead. Pick up Kitty. Next customer. Oh, grace. All right, dog. What is it, Mrs. Robinson? Have you heard of this mess? I, I, we saw that movie in um, Film Appreciation Class in College. Have you heard of this woman? Imagine having... Have you heard of this master woman? Imagine having the amount of power. Nations would kneel before you. You would be a god. That creature, it's huge. Unstoppable. She's describing me, what's in my pants. And they say it obeys her every command. It does not obey her every command. But it is a creature. It is huge and is unstoppable. It would certainly come in helpful with my father-in-law tomorrow. Father-in-law tomorrow. Oh, yeah, she is married, but she wants us on the side. She keeps us a side piece. That's fine. That's fine. I guess I'll just have to settle for some daisy cock doc to help get me <laughs> through it instead. Alright then, you want some daisy, huh? You want some daisy doc? You want that daisy? Alright. These flowers look the same, by the way. What the hell? Are plants really that similar and out there? Do Can you, can you like, make different kinds of plants breed? Or like, make love to each other to create like a new plant? Curious. No, mixed breed. Um, Daisy Doc. A simple potion that will grant courage can be brewed from the leaves. Primula familiaris. It is said that the ancient warriors would take it before going into battle. Okay, this looks like a leaf, not a plant. Oh, look at the dongs. They're getting rusted. BBCs. What else we got? It's not it. 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 It's this one. Oh my god, that is so easy. I'm not even gonna look at it. I should know we gotta read it. Purple flowers with a gentle scent. It's that one. Yeah, I get it wrong. Oh, they, yeah, they're so similar to this one. My bad, baby girl. Bluish, purplish flowers. Yeah, it's that one. Damn it. Damn it. What was it called again? I can't, can't remember the name. I won't look. I'm going to go by memory. What was it? Daisy. I'm not going to look at the book. I'm just, I'm just going to... Daisy. Uh, I'm not going to look at it. I'm pretty sure that's right. Don't, don't correct me. I think I'm right. Don't, 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 don't correct me. I think I'm right. 
But this is the plant that we identified, but we haven't got the little ding yet to know if it's true or not. So that's why we have it there, in case you guys are wondering. Put that here, wake up the kitty, hit the thing. Shafta, huh? Well, you a dog? He, he gossiped so much that I hate him. This letter was delivered in an unusual way. Don't care, don't want to know about it. There was no address provided, just the whole culture spelled wrong. It's not spelled wrong, that's how you spell it. The tea is silent, you douche. I have to assume it was meant for you. No beep, Sherlock. If you know your plans, this letter is for you. Can I turn this over? Ooh, you can right click to like zoom into it. I did not know that, but it doesn't support 4K. See how everything's like all blurred out? They did not optimize this game. You know your plants? Can I use a plant on it? No. No. Oh! Oh, baby girl. Ho ho. So you got it working. Oh yes, yes it works, it works. Look to the north of Baufel at the source of the river Esk. Nobody knows it grows there. It will be our little secret ho ho. And he ain't Santa Claus, so you know what that means, huh? Huh? Okay. You already know all the little, little tricks of this game now by now. Is it? You know, you know. Right. What is it? What does it say? Um. What place did he say? Bowell. Baufel. I remember Baufel because we used this. We've used this before. Nine hundred two and nine seven eight. So north of Baufel, at the source of the River Esk. That is River Esk. Baufel. Is it C fourteen? Or is it? Gonna, I don't even care. I'm just gonna click that. Sure enough, I did find a plant here that I've never seen before. How many plants, man? God, ooh, ew, that's a nipple if I've ever seen one. That's a nipple plant. That's a pacifier plant right there, dog. I need to close the shop for a minute and suck on that. Actually, you know, if I'm closing the shop and sucking on any plant, it's going to be the dong. Garbage, yo. Well, you, know, you know what that reminds me of? This reminds me of, um... This reminds me of goddamn Dwight using his urine to write coded messages that you have to put under the light to know what he wrote. That's what it reminded me of. Uh, wake up, little kitty bear. What you got going on? Thora Dune. Got a little Viking thing going on to her, huh? My husband likes to forge for mushrooms, but I'm worried about the ones he brought back from his latest venture. Roll that hoe up, Smokey. He's just been on trips across the lake, exploring the woods to the west of here. When I unbutton that top, he got a bag full of odd looking mushrooms that he says that are perfectly safe, but they will don't look edible to me. Just eat them, dog. Find out afterwards. I'd have brought one with me to help identify it, but he's hoarding them because he thinks I'm going to throw them out. Yeah, because you sound kind of like a little douche. Let him do what he wants. I'll come back tomorrow. Just how about stop being a little douche? Oh my god, that was loud. Mr. Dunn, mushrooms, woods west of underwear across the lake. Why am I doing people's dirty work? Like, go, you go look and find me the thing and bring it to me. West, never eat uh, soggy worms. Is it this? Straight west, right? Because this is under here, straight west across the lake. I'm just go here. Mushrooms! How have I never been here before? They're hard to find at first, but soon I'm seeing them everywhere. Oh dear god, man. It's another pair of red dongs this time. Yeah, I think this is gonna go all the way down to like day 30 or something. It is what it is though. I thought this was gonna be a more shorter game. That's why I chose this. But we're already eight hours deep into this game. Um, Wake up the kitty bear. Ooh, that is loud. That loud, that loud, that loud. Lord Fremont told me he was unable he was able to help you find some information on the servant. I've been looking all over the library, but of all I've discovered is a mold problem. It's not you spell mold. I hoped you might have some sweet breath that you could help that you could help clear it up. Um sweet breath. Palliance. Which one do you want? Sweet breath or palliance? I'm guessing they're different plants.
Most flowers offer. Wait, what did she say? Lord Freeman told me he was unable to find some information on the servant. I've been looking all over the library, but I've, all I've discovered is a mold problem. I hope you might have some sweet bread that could help clear it up. Off small improvement in air quality, but the palliance is in the class of its own. It's sometimes called sweet breath. Yeah, sure, I can give you that, though. You'll be trying to get it in me, but I, I, I ain't letting I let that happen, though. Palliance. That kind of looks like palliance. That also looks like palliance. Is it this one? Um, the, the many short leaves of this plant are thought to help filter toxins from surrounding air. It has a... Do you guys see that or not? If you don't see it, cool. Um, it has a pleasant, fresh aroma. Shortly, this pleasant aroma, thanks to the freshness of its air, in its vicinity. Kinda looks like it, but not really. It's not pointy, it's like rounded on the edges. This kinda looks like it. Somewhat pungent. Now, I kinda wanna go with this. But is it gross or not enough? I don't know. Is it like... Hmm... Hmm... Ah, I knew it. God damn it. Polyance. Give her polyance. Alright, so... One second. Someone's texting me. Um, alright, so we need to find a flower that is actually... So it's not this one, right? So we need to find something that... It's not this, is it? It's not that. I think it's this then, right? It has to be this. It has a pleasant, fresh aroma. Kind of, but like, this is longer. These are shorter. Well, these ones in the back are kind of longer. These are kind of short. Well, no other leaf kind of has this kind of quality, so we'll go with this. Palliance. And if I get it wrong, we should restart the day. We got it right. We're living on the edge right now. Sour Bandy. Um, which one was it? This one, right? It's really small, too. What is it called? Palliance. Palliance. Throw that up there. Close the book. Put that here. Alexa's... Okay, got the kitty. Yeah. Yeah. Lorena Chapman. My cousin will be married in three days. If you got some timble huff, then I'd uh, save me the trouble of going out to find some myself. If you knew my cousin, you'd know she's not worth the trouble. Okay, I don't know your cousin. Don't care about you. What's with those wrinkles in your forehead? Is that a chick? I think it's a chick. Yeah, Lorraine, a chop, and it's a chick. I was about to say, man, I can't tell, dog. Open the book, dog. Go to the table of contents, homie. Trimble, what is it one? Trimble buff. We're living on the edge right now. So we're going to just let her ride. Ooh, what is this? The tri the Cartier's parentheses. The Trimble Huff is traditionally used as a decoration at weddings and is thought to strengthen relationships across cross section of a small cup-like flower. Uh, is it the nipple? Um... They generally point downwards. Yeah, they're pointing. No, this one point. This one's upwards. Uh, to avoid filling with water and to allow ease access for pollinating insects. Pollinating insects. Okay, so it's. What about this one? Flowers are blue. Does it say it's blue? It does not say it's blue. This is cup like, and they're. This one's kind of facing upwards. And what it has a thing sticking out. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Does this have a thing sticking out? Yeah, this is a nipple. This is this is different. Yeah, it's this one. Well, let's just look through because this is our last ride right now. Cup like, cup like, cup like. Now it's facing upwards. So let's see yeah, this one. So this is called Trimble Huff. Y'all. I said, y'all. Glow horn. Finally, it's this nice glow horn right there. I can even tell you that right now. That's a glow, glow horn right there. Um, Pick this up and put it in here. Put a purple, and what's it called? Trimble... Oh. 
No keycap. Legends on the keycap, so calm down, alright? Calm down. Faster than any of you guys can type ever. I've clocked in 140, alright? 140. Um... End day. Oh, I didn't put everything away. Oh, I have OCD. OCD. Give me the card here, mate. The shepherd watched as she prepared the leaves and the roots and she would that she would require. He watched, oh my god, he's some stalker homie. He watched as the hours dragged by the sunset and she worked by candlelight, at times sitting still, at times moving like a dancer among the stones. He was looking at that booty, wasn't he? The change happened suddenly, but also subtly, so that at first the watcher was not sure that anything had happened, then he saw it. Full moon again. Wait, it's always been a full moon now. Ish. Oh, they all count like full moons. Okay. Eight miles to the east. You know, that kind of looks like a... Day 14 Thursday. Raining, finally. That thing actually looks like, um... This thingy. Yeah, it looks like that. Gosforth. Eight miles to the east. That's easy. And you guys think my memory is garbage. Gosforth. 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 Gosford. Eight miles. Gosford. Wait, eight miles to the what? East? Never east. So it's gonna be on this side. Yeah, there it is. Gosford. Eight miles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Should be here, right? Uh, eh. Gazing at still water of the lake, its black waters draw me into a reflective trance here and there. Flowers I don't recognize grow along the dock, along the bank. Now there are two more plants. Come on, man. Two more. Okay, let's do this. Day 14. I think we're halfway, almost halfway done with the game. I'm, I'm thinking the game is going to be max 30 days. Kitty, wake up. Always sleeping around. Wake up, all right? Plus, we haven't used even elixirs as much as all, so I'm thinking there's a lot more left in this game. Okay, so we got all of this. Got a bunch of new plants too, right? Got the dongs. I love these. Looks like a goddamn crepe. Okay, um... All the plants are almost named. Well, at least we have more plants named than plants that are not named. That's pretty cool. Uh, wake up the kitty. Found the horn. Bora Dune. Well, he went and ate those bloody mushrooms. And of course, now he's sick. Is there anything we can do? He's in a bad way and I'm worried about him. Um... Okay, so we do have... I remember there's antidotes. I read the word antidotes in the book. We went to that one place and got mushrooms. These, right? The red caps have a spongy texture. This is the mushroom we grabbed. We didn't grab any other mushroom lately, and we don't have any other mushrooms yet. This is the mushroom we went and got. Yeah, the red dong. We got when we went to the place that she told us to go find. What is it? Three mi across the lake of underwear or something? Um. So first we need to find out what red caps. I don't know what the name of this thingy is. So we identified the- that's the mushroom, right? That's the one we got? Is it something else? I'm trying to think. Uh... Okay, so I think we need to find out that, um... What kind of mushrooms are these? But we don't have it- they look kind of- they kind of remind me of these. These- we had another mushroom like this one. Hmm. Okay, so now we gotta go through this stupid book and find out a mushroom with a spongy feeling to it. First, we need to find out what, what mushroom this is, and usually when you go to a mushroom or whatever, it usually tells you um, what can be used against it, I think. Treatment for stomach pains, mushroom, spongy texture, spongy, spongy, not a mushroom. Produces a red flower, not a flower. Some say it's a lion. Love locks, not that. This one. Lion has a re rejuvenation effect, but most have tried to benefit from it. Realize that it's a, not, it is a curse. Could be this. This, this could be it. red patches. Are often seen growing 
No, these are the copper. This is right here, right? No, Bishop's Apostle. Copper Cadillium. Yeah, that's that one. That's a plant. Dead Man's Fingers. Oh, that is that? Is this Dead Man's Fingers? Fungus? The one we have right here? This one, don Dongs? Devil's Nightcap. Oh, yeah, this is the corpse's friend. I'm looking for mushrooms. 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 A spongy mushroom with potent abilities. Only safe to consume in small quantities. Looks exactly like that. Grants extra sh grants great strength at the expense of severe fatigue once the effect has worn off. Doesn't say though. But we did have that thing. Yeah, I remember we had a thing that talked about fungus. Fungus. Patterson's Guide to Fatal Fungi and Their Antidotes. Okay. Often fatal. That's the thing, though. Okay, we have copper, we have bishop, we have sunset, and we don't have spring wax cap. What is spring wax cap? Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Spring wax cap. No, this is pointy. That's not, that ain't it. So we had this is farmer's wart, 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 wart or whatever. I'm not 100% sure because we haven't heard that ding yet. What is it? Farmer's worry. So we're going to take this, put this right here. We're going to put a label on it, but we're going to leave it on the downstairs because I'm not 100% sure if that truly is because we haven't heard that ding yet. Farmer's worry. Plants up here, I've been 100% identified. Plants down here, if they have a label, that means I'm not 100% sure if they are what they say they are. Okay, according to this, Patterson, Robert, Rob Patterson's from Twilight Zone, or Twilight, uh, Guide to Fatal Fungi, warns of after Royal Gentia. Okay. Do we have that? The Royal Genitals. I feel like we already have Royal Genitals. We do. Okay. Royal Genitals. Uh, kind of looking for the plan before I go through all the names. Oh, this one is right here. Royal genitals. Yeah, yo. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. But I still don't know if those these red ones are that or not. But we're not gonna we're not gonna mess with it because I could place it up there, but I'm not 100 percent sure. So better to not. And we're gonna leave this here because this actually came in handy. Wake the kitty up. Ring the bell. Oh my god, man! I have been. Uh, to black home, I have fought the servant and lived, but still my adversary stands. God damn, his eye got gouged. It must be defeated. For my part, I am ashamed to say that I am done. Oh my god, homie. But why? Oh, San we have that, right? No. San Quentin's Elixir. What do you need for this? This Elixir will enable any drinker of it to overcome their sense of fear, though it should be considered beforehand that the fear is not always a bad thing. For example, it would not be wise to drink this near the to the edge of a cliff. A five-pointed leaf to grant courage, a red flower to protect the mind, a seed pod for luck. Okay. Well, at least we didn't, uh... At least he's alive. At least he's not dead. Because if you he would have been dead, that would have been sad. But now we need to... What do we need to do? Okay, so we need to find a five-pointed leaf to grant courage. How do I do that? Oh, dude, this one and this one, this, we could have gotten wrong. This, this kind of looks the same as this. Look, they kind of look the same. Look at that. Kind of look the same. Okay. Now we're looking for a five pointed leaf. Now, I don't even know if like these are things that I can actually find, find, or, um, or it's one of those things where. Like, uh, do I have these flowers or do I not have the flowers? That's the problem. So, San Quentin's, I'm getting a drinker. A five pointed leaf. Um, the Grand Courage, a red flower to protect the mind, a seed pod for luck. What even the hell is a seed pod? Five. Okay, so before we go to look for like plants that we already have done, I'm gonna say that it might be since we have so many plans that are unnamed. So let's go for this first. This is a, this is a shorter list. This is a long amount of people, and we have um, the rising dread. So well, I'm gonna end up using it. I'm not gonna use it. Okay, a five pointed leap to grand courage. 
Huh? Four. Five pointed leaf. Ooh, four. One, two, three, four, five. Five pointed leaf, but it's not like pointy pointy. The dark blue petals are soft and feathery. My fingers ache from handling this plant. A five pointed leaf. One, two, three, four, five. Never mind, it's six on this one. It's stupid. One, two, three, four, five. Five pointed. Kind of looks like, um. What's the word? It kind of looks like, um. What's that thing? The spade, the four, four leaf clover, four leaf clover. One, two, three, four, five. But it's not, it's not pointed. I don't know. We'll keep this on the side. <coughs> We're going to keep these to the side, excuse me. We're going to keep these to the side right here. That might be a thing. What is this one? Uh, through the baubles, look soft. They are quite, in fact, they're in fact quite hard. That kind of looks like a pod. I don't know what a what a pod really means. Like, what does a pod really look like? Also, we got to bring like a lot of these flowers here. I don't even know if they want me to use hints or not. Like, do they want me to use hints? I don't know what kind of hints they give you. That's the problem. So we're going to kind of put these in a place that I can actually use these. They're so put together. If I add another one. Can I still go through? Okay, cool. First, we do a little organization. Can I put another one? Yeah, okay, cool. That's good. And then put some of these on here. That's a little too much. Do we have another? Yeah, we do. This is not the best way to organize it, but at this point in life and time and the amount of hours you put into my uncle's shop, we are going to roll with it. I'm going to lean with it. I'm going to rock with it. Also, this is pretty fun to do. A little Valorant aim trainer. You will be going into what aim labs or whatever. I train my aim in goddamn or culture. That there, put that here. We don't want anyone to feel like there's too much going on there. Nice. Put that there. Okay. Okay, now we're looking for a. F this one looks like a pod. So I'm gonna put this right here. What was the other one we're looking at? We have more flowers here. What the hell are you doing over there? And then this one. These two look right. Um. What do we need? A seed pot, a red flower to protect the mine. Okay, a red flower to protect the mine. Okay, which, which one is this meek do? This is going to take a while. Beautiful flower, all difficult to care. Painful sores, not that one. Red flower, eye bright. Eye bright. Protect the mine. I remember there was a book page in here that talked about... Um... The mind protects the mind. Clarity or whatever. You know what? Can we find that? Something with the mind. I don't want to go to the right because the right is going to do a lot, a lot of more. Because I go through more through the alphabet. We're just going to go through here and see if we can find anything called mind, mind, mind. Mm, brittle, resource, resource, nobody knows. I strain. Um, frail. Backup claims, dark magic, complex or secure locks. What does really affect against all the matters? Matters of the mind. That doesn't help us though. What the hell is that? What the hell is that plant? This is a red flower that provides a shielding effect protecting against all manner of afflictions of the mind. Long thin stems grow among tall leaves. Ooh, thunder. You don't have it. Oh, this is actually easy. This is actually easy because we don't have it. We don't actually have it. Okay, this is a red flower. That's like a maroon. And that's the thing. This is the only one that could be it. Okay, it actually helped us because we don't actually have this flower. So, I'm gonna guess is this. If we get it wrong, I don't care. We need, to, we need to make one try. So, these three I'm thinking is it. So, we got the one. What does it say? 
five pointed one two three four five one two three four five five pointed a red flower to protect the mine i think is this because we haven't found it. it's not a check mark and there's no other red flower there this is a maroon red fruits long flat yes yeah, a fruit that's not a plant i can't believe we found candlewood Um, we're gonna- we're gonna name it. We're just gonna name it just to be safe. Candlewood. So this one, I think- but we won't- we won't put it up. We'll leave it down. Because, again, I'm not 100% sure if I'm right or wrong. Uh, Candlewood. Okay, we're gonna leave it down here, because I don't know. This is the only thing that resembles a seed pod. I don't see anything else in here that looks like a seed pod. Only thing is that it doesn't give me a good definition of it. No, the baubles look soft. They're quite hard. That looks like a pot to me. Looks like a goddamn pod that the Saiyans travel in. In Dragon Ball Z. Uh, nothing else has a circular pod that I can see. It's a mushroom. That's a band-aid on a plant. Yeah, none of these look like actual pod. Pod is usually a circle. I'm gonna go with that and then this. So let's see if this works. What was it? Pod on the bottom. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, Brian, is there a mistake or stick somewhere? I'm gonna think it's this flower. Because uh, it's not pointed. Alright? I'm not gonna be, I'm not an idiot. It's not pointed. Five pointed leaf to grant courage. That one's five. Put that down here. Pallions. So we'll use pallions for something else. Um. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, what is this? Pallions. We'll go. We have two more tries. Pallions. What's pallions? Uh, to grant courage. Yeah, this is for the freshness of the air. What is this? Not this one. That's pointed, though. I'm going to leave it down here. Uh, daisy cock. We just did this one. Simple potion. Grand courage. Grand courage. Who's this one? Put this back here. Put this back here. What is this? Daisy cock. Candlewood. These two I'm sure about, and this is the only one that can resemble a pot. If it's not this, then... I guess we just go back and go through here. For luck, then if it's not this, we know these two are right, then the pot can be the only wrong thing. And if that's wrong, we'll go through the entire book and we'll look for luck. If that's not the right one. Let's try it one more time. What was it? Luck at the bottom. Protect the mine with the red flower. And then five-pointed leaf. Come on, don't be black, don't be black, don't be black. That's great, we got it. A new elixir is acquired. That actually took us a while. Alright, can we finish this day or not? I kind of want to finish this day before we end the episode, so... Oh wait, we gotta give it to this person, right? Uh, San Quentin's Alexa. One, one moment, sir. Saint... Quentin's... I want to write San Quentin Jail. Let me write that. San Quentin... Is that a jail? Give him that. Please be right. Yes. More plant books. Okay. Okay, we're gonna put this here. That one's done. Pick up the kitty, ring the bell. David Schaffner. What do you want, man? There's a hateful man I sometimes see around town. He's called Isidore Burbage. Yesterday I saw him bending down. Ooh, how'd it look? On the back, huh? As though to pet a stray dog, but instead he punched as hard as he could. Dude, why wouldn't you what did you do? I rushed over and the coward fled. Okay, cool. You rushed over and the coward fled, but you should go after him to come up and someday he'll get it. Yeah, but you could have chased him, dog. You literally could have chased him. Sad Guild Chalice. I already know what this one is. This is the Holy Grail. Because isn't that what we'll call a chalice? Holy Grail. This is so easy. Alright, now we gotta look for Sad Guild. There's a castle. What is it? Sad? How do you say it? Sad Guild like that. Alright. Gospel. Amber Rose's backside. Sad girl. Sad girl. Does this even fit though? Chalice. This one. 
The chalice clue takes me directly south of Sadgill to a spot next to the river. Moss-covered rock line, the banks, velvet to the touch. In the moist conditions, a deadly-looking plant grows abundantly in the lush grass. Ooh, is that a Venus flytrap? I wonder what that plant does. I'm really curious about that and the dongs and the glow in the stick uh, sex toy. This one's done. That's there. We're at an hour. Let's just go a little bit more. I kind of want to see if we can end the day. Reuben Ward. Verona tells me you are working on gathering the plants for a ritual that will help us defeat- Oh! So yeah, so we were right. We're not supposed to do anything with this. We're supposed to just figure out what plants they are. We'll figure it out when the time comes. This will help us for defeat this this creature. I want to help in any way I can. From what Verona told me, I think this might be one of the plants needed to perform the ritual. But I'm afraid I do not know where it can be found. Swift's Snare. Don't we have this already? Oh, yeah, there it is. The Binder Ankle Grabber. Never let go. Are several names. Okay, Swift Snare. Do we have this one already? We might already have this one. I, I'm pretty sure I came across the Swift Snare. Someone mentioned the Swift Snare. Swift Snare. Pretty sure we have it, no? Swift Snare. You know, we'll, we'll worry about it when it comes to it. I'm pretty sure we have Swift Snare. I don't know why. It reminds me of a plant that we actually... Because someone talked about it. Someone mentioned something. Or I think it was that uh, the li library chick or something who was talking about um, the Swift Snare. I could be wrong, though. Because if we got it, we're getting a, we're getting the book for it, the page for it, that means we don't have a check mark for it. So I could be wrong. Then. So never mind. Don't listen to me. I'm an idiot. Um, okay. We'll do one more, and then... Um, I just want to end the, end the day. Ooh, Thaddeus Cornwall. Read somewhere about a plant that'll lead you to gold. I remember that plant. It has dropping... It has drooping red flowers and frilled leaves. I remember this one because, um... We were reading about it. Um, we found this one already because someone came to us for the same exact thing. Someone came to us for the exact same thing. Um... Open the book. It says uh, someone came to us for, uh luck or whatever. This time we'll start from the back and we'll go front. Gold. 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 It literally says gold on there. Blue alloy. Literally says gold on there. Bad luck. Big berries. Satchel induce. Gold. Weeping bell. Weeping bell. What did he say? Red flowers. Droopy red flowers. Droopy red weeping balls. There you go. Get the hell out of here, dog. Eat that thing from the bag, dog. Yeah, long enough. Okay. Day's still not ending. Wanna do one more? I want the day to end, man. Anus Elford. I can't help noticing that Drea Huntsman is still alive. Yeah, I didn't give it to him, dog. He's that stupid douchebag. You don't seem to understand the importance of a work here. I don't care. I'm not killing off a brother, dog. If you are not with us, then you are against us. When the redemption comes, it will come. You will regret your actions. And it will come, and you will regret your praise the dandruff. Alright, I'm cool with it, but I'm not killing the homie, dog. Especially your brother, I'm not killing him, man. You can go to hell, dog. There you go. Close the end of the day. So I can't remember people's face like that. I know Verona Green is the devil lady. I know that the weird guy with the chin and the beard is the detective. I know the Simone chick is the librarian, and I know the cougar girl who we're, uh, dating. Alright, I think we are officially at the halfway point in this game. Is what I want to say. Because I'm guessing this game is a 30-day game, and I think because I'm commentating, the game is going much lower than it should be, but... It is what it is. Decay gives way to new growth from death to life. And then, how do I read this? The Cy C Y cycle starts again west of which seer by the river. Okay, cool. Behind the woman, a dark skeletal figure began to rise and uh, in a low primal snarl started across the clearing. The shepherd turned and ran, cold fear coursing through his veins. He did not run for long because he got caught. But it still isn't a full moon. You see the left side of this moon isn't all the way circle. 
or when he passed it and I don't know I don't know day 15 Friday I'm guessing we're at the halfway point of this game now because I have so many goddamn plants that I have yet to find people to give so that's a lot of days this whole year is like six days in, of plants I need to give people even though five plants will be used for a ritual but I'm pretty sure five plants are some of the ones we already used before okay What does it say? Decay, give, it is garbage. We need the bottom part, which says the cycle starts again and then period west of white. S I said seer first. This is a scar by the river. Okay. Um, West of white seer. What does it say? By the river. West never eat White Seer. Never eat West. By the river. So exactly west. So is it P29? Yes, we found a dead body. A sun bleeds skull fixes me with his black gazed eyes. Gaze. Eyed ga black eyed gaze. A reminder from the chest of the skeleton a plant grows. That's the plant we have. That's the oh no, that's the book we got. Is it, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty sure it's this one. This plant right here is the one that grows out of you. Never mind, it doesn't look like that at all. So I killed the, this. This is the plant that kills you. We we, we had we got a, we got a page for this. The plant that kills you and then sprouts from within you. That's pretty cool. Okay, so it'd be kind of cool if this sprouted out of you, but it doesn't. All right, so another day is finished here in Compton. Let's close all this stuff. See the kitty's awake as well. Uh, another day, another dollar. We are um, getting paid handsomely. The script club under that. <sighs> oh. oh my god, the doms are hitting me. I just stretched and my biceps are spazzing me out because of the doms. <laughs> Had a good arm workout uh, this morning. But yeah, so this is, we finished 14 days. We still have a truckload of plants, as you guys can see in the shop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. Candlewood. I know this one already found out. Twenty five plants. Cauldry, farmer's worry. Yeah, we haven't gotten a full clearance on these yet, but, um, Yep, yeah, we got 25 plants or so still left and five plants a day. That's five days still at the very least. So we'll go to day 20 at least, I'm guessing. I don't know. Plus, we keep getting new plants. We still need to discover like a bunch of stuff on this map. Um, so yeah, I thought this game, I picked this game because it was a small, like, you know, short game, but it is not. It is pretty long. I know I'm commentating too, and it's a puzzle game and stuff, but uh, that looks like a person and that looks like the, each of the rivers looks like their hands. And they're trying to grab on to Lowood, Migglehead, and Beckfoot. Bigfoot. But yeah, looks like there is a lot more to this game than I thought there is. Um, and we just play slow. All, all of our all of our playthroughs are long plays. So if the game says it takes five hours to beat, most likely we'll do it in like eight to ten. Because it's just how long it takes. Plus it's still 100% this game, so I'm going to have to be playing off camera as well. So this is easily going to be... Right now we put in 8.6 hours, so... But I'm having fun. I'm I like it. It's just I just didn't expect this game to be this long. But I still enjoy it. I'm still having a great time. Um Day 15 though. We gotta finish day 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I'm I'm gonna put my guess at day 30 or day 31 is what I'm gonna put my guess at how long this game is. Cause I don't know. I like I said, I thought it was a short game, but I've been talking a lot and doing stuff, so maybe a lot of other people finish this game much sooner than I do. But I'm having a blast. Um finding out I hope these are real plants. The effects are fake, I know, but I hope the uh, plants are real because it's pretty cool how many different plants grow on this world and this uh, on this planet. In the same damn OST plays over and over again. I feel like on the bottom is where I should put all my plants, and on the top we should have plants we haven't discovered. So the next time you guys are here, I'm gonna make that switch right now. I'm gonna close the video, end the video, but I'm gonna make that switch right now. And then all the plants we haven't discovered will be at the bottom. The plants we have discovered will be at the at the bottom. And the plants we haven't discovered will be at the top. It's also one long line of plants that we've discovered. Because this gap right here is wasting time for us. But thank you guys so much for watching some more Strange Whole Culture. Our uncle's shop, the only legacy that he left behind for us. 
um besides the child support that we're still paying for him because you know he's he's made mistakes in his life but it's okay and we have his uh kitty named sativa that we will love more than anything in this world and i will see you guys next time when we open up shop again on day 15 friday peace